Here's the thing, I don't live in the mountains, I live by the sea. And this month, I wasn't able to get to the mountains to shoot. The reality is, as a landscape photographer, you're not always able to get out and shoot the places you love. We had a change of plans, finally took some time to slow down and appreciate our home. We are off to Norfolk today, which is a two hour drive up north. Um, the plan is to go to Setford Forest for the morning, get some nice foresty shots, maybe see some deer, fingers crossed. And then later on in the afternoon we're going to head further up north up to Old Hunstanton. Um, I've been there before and there's just some beautiful orange cliffs and stuff that I really want to take some drone footage of. And yeah, hopefully catch a nice sunset. There's been a shift of energy this July. The start of the year was full of possibilities. The future for Rob and I isn't so clear now, it's murky and full of uncertainty. Something huge Rob and I have been working towards fell through and it's been hard keeping at the same pace and it's hard to bounce back.
we can do is look forward and find our way out of the woods, continue to work hard towards a new goal, whatever that will be. pretty thick jumper and um, I just get cold really quickly but um, it's July. Rob and I won't be going on any hiking trips or pretty much anything this summer really. Um, about two weeks ago now we um, we were getting ready to go for a trip. We supposed to be going to Norfolk and we found a baby seagull that had dropped off of our roof has been really badly injured he's got um he's got a really really bad leg yeah so it, we were kind of left with no choice but to look after him ourselves he just means that we can't go on our trips because he needs looking after so we're not going to the Breckens and we're not going to Snowden um so we're gonna have to find some day trips to do around the um eastern side of the UK Can I have this grape? <laughs> I'll give him the grape. Thank you. 